This series is so fabulous. And both of you have done so many wonderful things in your journey. What was the most important tone for you that you wanted to set for this particular series? Mm. Yeah, lot, lots of things, actually. I mean, the female-driven aspect of it, it was getting across um, the, the, the intricacies of, of female leadership. Um, some of it is quite brutal and overt. Other things are a lot more subtle and hard to really show. Um, so, yeah, it was getting across that. But I think for me, I, I really wanted to get across that emotional connection to, to wildlife. And doing it through you know, female-led societies seems almost easier because there is that sort of, you know, there's just that other dimension to it, an emotional dimension and a nurturing dimension. And, and, and just that sort of, just creating that link between humans and wildlife, you know, that bond that we have that we've slightly lost and just bringing that back and making people feel more connected. And collaboration and support, how a community and a network can support each other and lift each other up. I think both through the animals and the people, we were able to show that. Well, you had some such amazing shots that I felt that were so intimate. To talk about those shots with the elephants and then you got into the eyes and the zoning and things that were so beautiful and so specific and things we wouldn't think about. Even when like, she kicks the little baby away to protect, you know, mm. all, all this stuff. It was just brilliantly done. So in that space, when you're doing these shots visually, what are you looking at? What are you looking for? You're trying to tell a story. You're trying to give the audience the best story you can from each animal. So for the elephants, um, when the baby first comes out, you meet the elephant for the first time. You see the trunks coming down and touching her. It's mm. having people feel what you're feeling while you're there, mm. having people you know, be immersed in it like you're one of the elephants almost with them and seeing them touch and hearing the rumbling and, and just being completely immersed in that moment. That's, that's, it's the story. Yeah. That beautiful, that, that, um, communal nurturing that elephants yeah. do is, yeah, it's beautifully captured as well on screen, but it, it, you know, it's, it's such a wonderful thing. And that, that intelligence that you can see going through with the matriarch there and, just everyone coming together. Who of you would love the audience to take away when they watch this beautiful series? What would you like us to come away with? Well, definitely that um, that women have a role, equal role in society and in our field in, in wildlife filmmaking, it's in it's in a really a key and crucial thing that it's balanced because it it, it changes so many things. It changes um, who tells the stories and how the stories are told. And, and it's important that people from all over the world have a chance to tell their own stories about the natural world. And, um, you know, that inclusivity is, 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 is really key. And it's connecting other audiences to the screen. Um, Faith's episode is a prime example of that, that last final episode. You see faces on screen that you've never seen before. You hear languages mm. on on the, on the film that you've never heard before. It's having little kids being able to look at the TV and go, that could be me. Like, I see myself yeah. in that person. And I think that's something that Queens did so well was create representation on camera we've never had before and behind camera. Yeah. The seventh episode really was was important because, as you say, just seeing seeing everyone on screen and just, you know, like those jobs that the, 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 the female rangers yeah. in Kenya, you know, you're just like, I didn't know they, I didn't know that was a thing. Yeah. And also, you know, how they describe their access into the communities because women mm -hmm. will speak to other women, you know, and they might not trust men. And, uh, you know, so you just do these things you never thought about before. And you think, yeah, but that's just sort of window into another world. And yeah, it's. Uh, yeah. It was it was amazing, and also the Rangers. One of them's pregnant in the shot, and it's like I was like, "That is incredible!" Yeah, like that yeah, yeah. to me was so exciting too. It's just showing women doing doing things that they can do, and yeah. and being. And I just hope it empowers a lot of the younger generations. Being capable. If you're 
you can describe it in three words, and you cannot repeat each other's words, how would you describe it? Well, we each have to do three. Um, okay, empowering. I was going to say e- that. Exciting, <laughs> empowering, exciting, and innovative. Uh, oh, gosh. I didn't stutter. take the other two, we did. <laughs> um, uh, cooperation and um, emotion and beauty. And there you go. Thank you so much. Thank you.